Thomas Markle was loaded into an ambulance in Tijuana by paramedics on Monday at around 9.30 p.m. According to TMZ, Mr. Markle was unable to speak to paramedics and was forced to write his symptoms down on a piece of paper. He was initially transported to a hospital in Tijuana, Mexico, where he was pictured arriving with an oxygen mask strapped to his face. He is later thought to have been transported to a hospital in Chula Vista, California. According to his daughter, Samantha Markle, he remains in hospital. In a statement, she said, My father is recovering in hospital. We ask for privacy for the family, for his health and well-being. This is not the first health scare experienced by the 77-year-old. He suffered two heart attacks in the lead-up to Meghan and Harry's wedding in 2018 forcing him to pull out of attending the nuptials. His latest health issue means he may not be able to attend the Queen's Jubilee this year. He recently announced that he would be flying back to the UK for the event. Speaking to GB News about the Jubilee, he said, I'm looking forward to it. I'm going to show my respect for the Queen and I'm going to make sure that the Queen understands that my entire family respects the Queen and the Royals. We admire them and we want them to know that's how we feel about them and that's how we feel about England. He added, I would like to meet with Prince Charles and thank him for walking my daughter down the aisle, and also to meet and talk with him because I think we have a lot in common now. We've pretty much both been ghosted by our children. In the same interview, Mr. Markle criticized Meghan and Harry for coming to the UK without their two children when they visited the Queen earlier this month. He said, not bringing the children was like another slap in the face to the Queen. It was very rude and the wrong thing to do. It makes no sense at all. I don't know if it's Meghan or if it's Harry but the Queen should have every right to see her great-grandchildren and I should have the right to see my grandchildren. So if they show up I hope they bring the kids.